Around 71% of the Earth's surface is covered in water, and there's plenty of H2O to be enjoyed in most corners of the world. From lesser known seas and mammoth lakes to rivers that snake their way through the landscape, there are some truly awesome bodies of water just waiting to be discovered. And thanks to the power of nature and preservation by humans, some of that water is clearer than you might ever have thought possible. Coming up are 10 of the most beautiful places around the world where the water is crystal clear. Number 10. Te Waikoropupu Springs Formerly known as Pupu Springs, Te Waikoropupu Springs is the largest freshwater spring in New Zealand and the largest cold water spring in the Southern Hemisphere. The water is pumped up out of ginormous aquifers at an unfathomable rate of 14,000 liters per second. To give that figure some context, that's the equivalent of filling 40 bathtubs per second. The reason the water is so clear is that it spends up to 10 years being filtered by the surrounding rocks before it surges out into the pools. The waters are so clear, in fact, that they've attracted their fair amount of scientific attention. In 1993, the National Institute for Water and Atmosphere carried out optical tests on the springs and found that visibility was an incredible 63 meters. You'll find these spectacular falls close to the town of Takaka in Golden Bay at the end of a pleasant 30-minute stroll. Number 9. Jishegu Valley Lakes Jishegu is a nature preserve and national park located in the north of the Sichuan province in southwest China. The UNESCO World Heritage Site attracts millions of visitors each year with its multi-level waterfalls and spectacular mountain ranges. But its most incredible attraction is Five Flower Lake. Of more than 114 lakes in the national park, it stands out because of its multicolored waters. As you might have guessed by the name, there are at least five colors visible at any one time. This is because of the calcareous sediment at the bottom, as well as the variety of algae and the colorful forest reflecting on the water's glass-like surface. If you fancy a visit, October is the best time to go, as the forest turns shades of red, orange, and even purple, which makes it even prettier. Number 8. Plitvica Lakes National Park, Croatia Founded in 1949, Croatia's Plitvica Lakes is the oldest national park in Southeast Europe, and it's so beautiful, it's a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It's huge too, and its maze of 16 lakes and waterfalls cover over 70,000 acres. Over 1 million people head out to see the Jewel of Croatia each year, and looking at these scenes, it's easy to see why. The 16 lakes are interconnected, and the water flows through all of them as it travels through the park, but they're separated into upper and lower clusters, which are formed by runoff from the mountains. The water's world-famous colors range from blue and gray through to turquoise and green, depending on the number of minerals and organisms and the angle of the sunlight. If you want to take a trip to Plitvica, it's 130 kilometers from the capital Zagreb, and it's well worth staying for a couple of days to see the colors change. Number 7. Ambergris Key, Belize Around 1.3 million people visit Belize each year, and Ambergris Key, the largest island, is the main destination for travelers. The key reason people flock there is to scuba dive, and after taking one look at these crystal clear waters, it's easy to see why. The area is also home to the second largest coral reef system in the world. The whole Chan Marine Reserve lies just one and a half miles off the coast of Ambergris Key and is an incredible 25 miles long. Around 40,000 people snorkel or dive here annually, hoping for a glimpse of the huge variety of sea life in the area. If you're wondering why oceans like the Caribbean Sea are so beautifully blue, science has the answer. The blue is created when the sun's rays are scattered by the water molecules. The water is lighter in the shallows because the sunlight is bouncing off the sand and reefs that sit near the surface. Number 6. Melisani Lake, Greece Greece is one of the world's greatest locations for history and beauty, and Melisani Lake combines the two to become one of the most fascinating natural attractions in the world. Depressingly, the lake is said to have been named after a heartbroken nymph. According to legend, Melisani took her own life after being spurned by the god Pan. 
The cavern is located two kilometers outside the popular tourist destination of Sami and is thought to be around 20,000 years old. The lake was completely underground at one point, but a huge earthquake opened it up thousands of years ago and now sunlight floods in and lights up the water with an array of beautiful blue tones. The lake is so incredibly clear because the cave acts as an aquifer, which means that seawater is sucked into the cave and is filtered during the process. Don't be tempted to take a sip of the water though. Although it's been filtered, it still definitely tastes like salt water. Number five, Gruner Sea. Also known as Green Lake, Gruner Sea got its name thanks to, you've guessed it, it's green but incredibly clear water. This lake in Styria, in the southeast of Austria, is home to the most spectacular emerald green waters you could ever imagine. The clean, clear water comes from the snow melt from the Karst Mountains. Because of the water's origins, the lake is extremely shallow during the winter months, but the water levels begin to rise once the weather warms up and snow begins to melt faster. The lake used to be hugely popular with divers who would head there in droves to take advantage of the 50 meter visibility and the underwater meadows, footpaths, and benches. But all water sports were banned in 2016 because experts worried that the sediment stirred up by divers was resulting in the clear green waters becoming murky. Number four, Rio Sucuri, Brazil. The Amazon might be the most famous river in Brazil, but those in the know will tell you that the Rio Sucuri is by far the most beautiful. Located in Bonito, four hours drive from Brazil's capital, you'll find Rio Sucuri hidden inside the riparian forest. After a short walk, visitors are rewarded with a natural aquarium rich with aquatic plants and shoals of colorful fish. The water is so incredibly clear because it originates from artesian wells. It then springs out of the ground to form pools with visibility of up to 18 meters. And Brazil's government is so keen to preserve the natural wonder that the entire area is protected, being declared a national park. Number three, the Philippines. There are so many incredibly beautiful and crystal clear waters found in the Philippines. A few places from this beautiful country deserve a mention. First up, Palawan Island, which is perhaps the best known place in the Philippines to swim in glassy ocean waters. The Palawan Archipelago sits in the South China Sea and the Sulu Sea and attracts over 1 million visitors every year with its reefs, wildlife sanctuaries, and UNESCO World Heritage Sites. One of the main draws to the area is the opportunity to scuba dive at the site of 12 Japanese shipwrecks from World War II. The Philippines is also home to the Hinechuan Enchanted River, which can be found on the island of Mindanao. The river's beautiful colors and its unexplored depths have bred many legends, including the theory that fairies add the blue tones to it when nobody's looking. In actual fact, the clarity of the water is due to its origins in the jungle's deep springs. But no visit to the Philippines would be complete without a trip to Boracay Island. It's calm, clear, turquoise bay once hosted two million people each year, and this had a terrible effect on the Paradise Island, so the president shut it down for a thorough cleanup. The island reopened, but with a new list of strict rules, including no beach parties, limited water sports, and no vomiting in public. Consider yourself warned. Number two, Flathead Lake, Montana. Flathead Lake in Montana is the largest natural freshwater lake in the west of the US and is known around the world by how incredibly clear its water is. Check out these photos of visitors floating on the lake's surface. The water is so clear, it looks as though they're levitating. The lake is actually the remnants of a huge inland sea called Lake Masula, which covered a lot of the region around 13,000 years ago. It's actually 370 feet deep at its deepest point and is said to be the cleanest lake of its size in the world. The main reason that the water is so clear is that it originates from the surrounding Rocky Mountains and consists of pure snowmelt. Locals take very good care of their natural wonder and ensure that there's no chance of pollution whatsoever, which helps to keep the lake so pristine. Before I reveal the world's number one location for clear water, I have a couple of honorable mentions that are too spectacular to ignore. This incredible shot was taken by photographer Ian Coble for outdoor clothing manufacturer Mountain Hardware. 
The shoot took place in Ho Rainforest on the Olympic Peninsula in western Washington state. The Ho River originates at the Ho Glacier on Mount Olympus, and the glaciers grind rock into fine glacial flour, which turns the river a slate blue color. The stillness of the water allows the glacial sediment to settle, which makes it crystal clear. This crystal clear lake in Sabah, Malaysia also deserves a mention. Located in the northern part of Borneo Island, visitors can take advantage of the area's freshwater wetlands and spend the day paddleboarding on the flat and clear mirror-like water. Number 1. Blue Lake, New Zealand Blue Lake, also known as Radamer Wenua, holds the title of the world's clearest lake. Located in Nelson Lakes National Park on the South Island of New Zealand, Blue Lake underwent scientific testing in 2011, and the results showed it to be the clearest natural body of fresh water known to man. Visibility is as high as 80 meters, which makes it almost as optically clear as distilled water. The spring-fed lake is so incredibly clear that local Maori tribes regard it as being sacred, so trying to take a dip could land you in big trouble. The national park is open for hiking, camping, and fishing though, so at least you can gaze upon the water's beauty from the lake's edge. To see it at its best, visit in summer. The higher position of the sun means that more light hits the surface of the lake, turning it a vibrant shade of blue. My oh my. The world is a beautiful place, I'm sure you'll agree. Which place would you most love to visit? And do you think we should be allowed to swim in these crystal clear waters? Let me know in the comments down below, and thanks for watching.